Welcome back, friends. When us we left off. Oh man, things are about to get a little bit ridiculous. If you want to live, get down now. I wish that's how I talked in real life and fake life. Is that the military? What the hell kind of gun is that? Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. So when does that guy die? Dad! Oh, good. Good. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> He's gonna turn into a zombie. Uh, jump up and down on his, on his head. Um, I told him to calm down. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's smart. <laughs> My pills. You think? Uh, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get what in there. What an Behind idiot. Behind the counter where the pills are. Somehow. We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so much. We need nitroglycerin pills. She... Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Is all Everyone over the place. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. I like Agreed. you a lot, boy. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Woo! Isn't that the shirt from Evolution with David Duchovny? Oh, I love that movie. That'd be great. Damn, that'd be great. Ah! <laughs> well, it's gotta Damn. get Damn. Plus, I'm quick, and I know Macon. Yeah, and I like Bacon. Born and raised. Hell if you're yeah. Gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. And by the way, Hopefully, fist bump. Dead. Cool. Clementine's fist bump. One. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you, what's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Your dad's dead. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. Who the hell is that? Doug, you got it. Samwise Ganji. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly, you'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. Potato! Now, You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Oh, now suddenly he's the boss? <laughs> I'm the boss, man. Look at me. How's he the boss? Oh, energy bar? Hell yeah. I'm gonna need some of that. What you got going on over here, radio? Messing around with there. A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. I, uh, have experience with radios. Let's see. Power? Oh, clearly. Hmm, nothing. Great. Well, beyond that... Oh, maybe the volume's turned all the way down. <laughs> that would be awesome. Nothing. Dang it, this is harder than I anticipated. Oh, batteries? <laughs> this is so easy. I found the problem. Batteries in this thing. You're an well, idiot. Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> no. Typical. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. What? <laughs> oh, what do we got going on here? Easter egg hunt, IT guy. Okay, apparently nothing. Yo, what's up, uh, Samwise? Never seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> You're hilarious. I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate up there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. You first. Oh, huh. What the hell's on your shirt? Is that a bear with antlers? You're an idiot. Uh, you know what? Not now. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. Yeah, sure thing. I gotta, you know, let's take a look around. Oh, bear keg. Cash register's already been raided. Oh, greeting cards? Oh, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead gods. Oh man, I found the batteries. I fixed the radio. What, what, wait, what's that? What's that? What's that? Fingerprints? Is that what that said? Photographs, fingerprints. Pfft. Is this my store? <laughs> okay. Newspapers. Nothing of interest. I don't remember them very well. What do you mean you don't remember them very well? Is this my store? 
He doesn't you remember his family. Anything happened to Ducky? I know, hon. Haley really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got that your ass, you know? man. You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Push comes anyway, to shove. We, Cat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Your son's kind of an idiot, but uh, you know what? How's he doing? You know what? How are you guys? Are you guys doing? all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? I we killed a man. Through a lot. I ran that guy over with a tractor, and then he couldn't get up. <laughs> How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're yeah. lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Little kid. How's she doing? Oh, snap. What do you mean she's good? You haven't even checked on her since the zombie, man. Well, don't say that. Don't say that. Say she's that. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. Ah. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. It takes a special little girl. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? Yes. That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Did I ever find out what happened to my family? Because it looks like it wants me to tell them that they're dead. Like, I've seen that a few times. Oh, this is my place! They, uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, oh. sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Lee, oh. you got a second? Sure. Now I feel bad. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. My son killed a man. Panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. But why would you be? Who who's proud of panicking? Eh. It happens. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah. That's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You yeah, think you, you did. do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. Yeah, you do. I guess. You're just not the stuff heroes are made of, boy. Try to let it go. Let's have a bro hug. Come here. Or not. Either way. <laughs> Why the hell did you run him over, duck? <laughs> He's like, put your back into it! <laughs> and then the guy's like, oh, duck. And then he was like, oh my god, duck, what the hell? And then the zombies popped out of nowhere. And before you know it, here we are. Careful, man, there's a zombie in there. Alive inside? Where's your hammer, man? It's hammer time. And why is the little girl behind you? Are you serious? You're not going to last long at all in this video game, kid. You're probably going to die in about tree fitty. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Is that your family's blood, man? That's messed up. Oh, man. How are you doing? Okay. <laughs> I'm convinced. She's okay, guys. Don't worry. Zombie just tried to kill her, and she's standing in a room full of blood with a stranger, and her parents are missing, but she's okay. That store leads to the back alley. Good thing they barricaded it. Woo okay. Oh, first aid kit. First aid kit. Hell yeah, man. Pick the hell. Put it in your pocket. Strap it to your back. Do something. My parents came in here hoping to survive, but it looks like one of them. Be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. You know, it looks like somebody was more than hurt, man. Like, you know, I'm not a doctor, but that's a lot of blood. There's a photo over there. There's a photo over there. Yeah, how about you pick it up, genius? Take. Oh, man. Those were the days. Your brother became a doctor? You must feel worthless. Find anything? Ah! 
I didn't hear you come in. Oh no, he has family issues. Just a picture of whoever was here. It was you. It I know who you are. Uh oh. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. Nah, <laughs> fist bump. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? You know, I tell people what I want. No, I've been sticking to first names for a reason. I mean, it's the truth. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. You might be the I'll one with the problem. I'll just keep it to myself. Girl. <laughs> um... Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Can we have a hug? You know, it's still the deal with the hug. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Alright, friends, I'm going to go ahead and pause it here. Subscription button is in the top middle. Next episode is in the top right. I hope to see you there because, uh... I mean, it can only go up from here, right? <laughs> Until then! <laughs>